hello students today we are going to learn about how to use moody's chart how to see moody's chart the purpose of moody's chart okay and how to use it and this is a small short and lucid lecture you will easily learn that how to use this chart okay so first of all moody's chart is particularly used to find the friction factor of pipe made up of commonly used materials okay so you might be knowing about the losses in pipe flow major head loss and minor head loss in case you don't know that then you must check out my that lecture first which is made for this losses in pipe flow right now i believe that you know what is major head loss in pipe flow major head loss occurs due to action of friction of inner wall of pipe on the flow of fluid means the losses takes place due to friction of pipe on the fluid flow is major head loss and it is given by darcy wishback equation which is the head loss hf is equals to 4 flv square by 2 dg here f is the friction factor l is the length of pipe v is the velocity of flow d is the diameter of pipe and g is acceleration due to gravity so this is the major head loss now over here you can see this f so moody's chart is particularly used for to find this value of f for a particular kind of pipe now this is how the moody's diagram or moody's chart look like now you have to learn the chief things in regards of this chart that i am telling see left hand side y axis is telling the friction factor this y axis is telling the friction factor the x axis is telling the reynolds number of flow which is given by rho vd by mu for pi we know that and this right hand side y axis tells the relative pipe roughness so what it exactly is we will learn it by the help of a numerical right now you just keep in mind that the right hand side y axis is called as relative pipe roughness okay and you can see these blue lines you can see going straight toward left and then uh, taking curve okay these are constant relative pipe roughnesses constant means in case relative pipe reference over here is 0.04 then through this entire blue line it will remain 0.04 similarly this is 0.005 through this entire blue line it remains 0.005 okay now we will take a numerical see determine the head loss due to friction per unit meter of length major head loss in a pipe through which water is flowing with velocity 4 meter per second means for 1 meter length of pipe they have to find the major head loss the velocity of flow is 4 meter per second and the material of pipe is steel however it is rusted so actually it is you can say it is old steel made up of steel so it is rusted steel the diameter of pipe is 15 cm it means it is 0.15 meter and density of water is given and viscosity of water is given okay so first thing you have to find the reynolds number so that is rho vd by mu rho is 1000 velocity of flow is given 4 meter per second diameter of pipe is given 0.15 meter and mu is given 0.78 into 10 to the minus 3 so reynolds number is coming out to be 760456 okay so for this uh, moody table we have found the reynolds number see it is 10 to the power 3 means 1000 this is 10000 this is 1 lakh and this is 10 lakh so 7 lakh 60000 456 is somewhere over here so, so we have to predict it wisely okay so this 7 lakh 60000 must be somewhere over here between 1 lakh to 10 lakh so 1 lakh 2 lakh 3 lakh 4 lakh 5 lakh something like this so over here this 7 lakh 60000 456 so reynolds number we have found now the material of pipe is uh, steel rusted steel so again go to moody's chart so you can see that in case the material is steel and it is rusted then this is epsilon this is the roughness of the pipe which is in mm so for rusted steel it is 0.5 okay now you have to find the relative pipe roughness that is equals to the roughness of pipe upon the diameter of pipe so here it is found for rusted steel it is 0.5 so upon the diameter so here uh, for uh, rusted steel the epsilon is 0.5 and diameter of pipe is since 0.5 is in mm you can see the unit is mm so upon diameter must also be in mm so upon 150 so it is giving 0.0033 okay so again go to moody's chart round number we have found now 0.0033 this is 0.002 and 0.005 so it it must be somewhere in between so actually the line was not drawn in this moody's moody's chart but we have to predict it see it is somewhere in between so by the help of this red dotted line i have made the constant relative pipe roughness line that is of 0.0033 somewhere over here okay now what happens see the reynolds number is this and constant relative pipe roughness line is this wherever these two lines are intersecting from that point go toward left so wherever this is intersecting to this uh, left hand side y axis over there whatever the number is you can see it is interacting over here 
so it is something something 0.028 because this is 0.02 and this is 0.03 so it is more closer to 0.03 so it must be we can predict it it is 0.028 so the friction factor of the pipe is 0.028 so this is how we have we can use the moody's table moody's diagram or moody's chart to find the friction factor now uh, we know this thing that uh, the head loss is given by 4 flb square 2 dg so f we have found 0.028 you can keep L length of the pipe we have to take 1 meter because we have to find the head loss per meter of pipe and V is given that is 4 meter per second D is given that is equals to 0.15 meter so putting all the values the head loss is found to be 0.60 meter per meter of pipe length so hope by this small lecture you would have learnt that uh, what is Moody's chart why it is used and how to use it thank you